Hello everyone, welcome back to DMARC DKIM. Today's video is about configuring DNS records in Resend for domain authentication. You can add the DNS records to the DNS provider for verification and to secure the email communication against spoofing and spamming. So let's start. On your recent dashboard, go to Domains option. Here, click on Add Domain. Write down your domain here. Select your region and click Add. Here you have the MX and TX3 records. We will add these records to the DNS provider. My domain is from Cloudflare, so I have logged in my Cloudflare account. In the Websites tab, click on your website and go to DNS, click Records, and here you can add a new record. Click Add Record. Let's add the first record, which is an MX record. Select Type MX and copy the record name, add it in the name field. Now copy the record value, add it in the mail server field, set the priority to 10 and then click save. Now let's add the second record, this is a SPF record. Before adding the SPF record, you have to make sure that your DNS provider doesn't have an existing SPF because Due to the limitations of DNS providers, we can only add one SPF record to the dashboard. If you have to add multiple SPF records, you can merge them and combine them into one single value. For this purpose, you can use the SPF merge tool. Link is given in the description as well. You have to write down your domain name here. Then you have to add the SPF value here and click merge. So here this tool detects your existing SPF records and combines it with the new SPF to give a single combined value which contains both values. You can edit your previous SPF record, replace this value with the new one and click save. And now both values will work just fine. Next one is a DKIM record. Let's move to the DMARC record. This DMARC value is a PNUN value, which only provides initial monitoring and it is not helpful for implementing a strict policy. Moreover, it does not have the destinations where unauthorized emails will be going. Without the destinations for the emails, you cannot have insights about your email performance. Without the insights and the DMARC reports, you cannot take necessary actions to implement a strict policy. That is why we have built a tool that not only helps you implement a strict policy, but it also provides you with actionable insights on your dashboard. Go to dmarkdkim.com and write down your domain here. Click check. At the first step, it analyzes your domain and then provides you a value accordingly. Initially, it provides monitoring, but after that, you can implement a strict policy based on your DMARC reports. You have to add this value to your DNS provider. After adding the value, sign up here. To get access to the reports dashboard, you have to add your business email to sign up here. After signing up, you will have this dashboard. Click on the red highlighted text and scroll down to click check DNS records. And now the both values are turned green. Your domain is now verified and now it is able to receive the DMARC reports. After adding the DMARC value, this tool starts generating the DMARC reports after 24 hours. If you delete the records from your DNS dashboard, you will still be able to recover them from this tab. It stores your previous records as well. So it is easy to recover from human error. After you have added all records, you can go back to the DNS page and click verify DNS records. 
as you see the records are verified if your records do not get verified after 24 hours there might be a misconfiguration in your dns setup if you are unable to figure out where the issue is you can hire a dmogdkm.com expert to help you out you can find the link in the description Go to the link and schedule a meeting with one of our experts if you want assistance. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care and have a good day.